I don't want to play this. Grinding. What? Why was I grinding? Oh yeah, we did all that. Also, the game bugged out on me again. I got to the end of a floor, and then uh, it just sat there. I went to the stairs, and then the game just sat there. I never went to the results screen, so I couldn't actually progress. I had to quit out. That, that really cheesed me off. Whew. I feel safe with less lum glub. Why do you need to feel safe? You could just punch them. This help you find many relics of ancient time. I found like five of those while I was doing your quest. Can you quest for me? You find person for Susan? I, I can't find sweet little person. Fuzzy tasty. <coughs> I think a sultry she sounded there. I'm pretty sure she's talking about Starchy, who we find... Soon enough. Next couple floors? I don't even remember. I don't know. We find starchies eventually. This love cannon is perfect. Just a few minutes at 350 and I call it the Crusade Wave because bad guys will wave goodbye. Polite ones will anyway. I don't think that's how it works. Yay! We'll never use this. I was pretty sure I showed it off. Thanks for all your help. Nope, oh, we're done all her quests. We will never use you. Do we need... We need that for a quest. We need... I think we already did that one. We need this for a quest. We need crabs for a quest. Do we need anything else? I don't remember. Also, that, that bread shot took me forever to find. Holy crap. Just like the kitten gun. This game hates me when it comes to finding things that I need. And I don't want any of this. Dang it, game. I'm going to two of these, I guess. This metal, this metal indicate I have yeah, he has lines for literally every item. Where are you, Finn? Wasn't so, I upgrading you? Yes, I was. I gonna punch that in the We're going to use Finn, because... Just because, really. I can jump you to later. Oh, yeah, I played ahead slightly. Keep in mind, so your because that was the best place to grind monies. All right, so we're going to do float. We're going to do speed up. We're going to do. I kind of want to do that, but let's see what else we got. We can actually block now, so. This is all lame, though. So I don't like that. I was just dying. You don't. You do. I just don't like when games do that because you don't actually ever die in this. You just pass out and wake up on the top floor. Marceline actually doesn't even pass out. She just says, "Forget this," puts on her hat and warps out. <laughs> I was playing with Jake and I went down. Yeah, he just falls unconscious. Yeah, new area. Hello. This is where the game is playing. Yeah, we can block now. Dodge. Do all sorts of stuff that Marceline can't. Actually, just block and dodge. Uh, is there any reason for me to even get money eh? right now? There is not. So screw it, we're just gonna... Also, this music is new to me. Also, the game is super quiet all of a sudden. Why is that? Did I mess with these? I think I may have. Actually, no, I'm leaving that down. Whatever. The game is super quiet. Um... No, hey, that was the exit. Yeah, it just occurs to me. 
I've never, um... Oh yeah, Finn's last hit has knockback, which is actually really good. Oh wow. And look at that, the freaking quest reward. I hate this game. <laughs> I'll take a banana ray and screw these things. But yeah, I have um, actually never gone into this place with the game unmuted, I don't think. Or maybe just this song I don't recognize. But... But yeah, I picked the tiny wings thing so we're floating, even though it doesn't look like we're floating. So, uh, see that pit? Screw that pit. Now you key me. Items, grabbing items. Gold piece. I'm a talking thing. Hey, where's the other one's armor? Also, his chest opening animation takes far too long. So does Flame Princess. Yeah. But yeah, fully upgraded Finn is actually probably the best character. He's who I used for the Nidosphere anyway, just because... Give him flight, and there you go. <laughs> Give him flight, speed up in Zeldron's armor, and you're set. Uh, nope, I remember this song. So. Also, look, my imagination meter's already filled. That's right. Anyone who isn't Marceline, they fill their imagination meter by just beating on things. Gold piece. So it's pretty much an overdrive. Um... Marceline actually has the hardest time, because she has to either eat red food or absorb red projectiles. Which in the early game is fine, but later on it's like, yeah, it's really tedious. Unless you meet tons of those dynamite guys and you can just very quickly get an entire imagination there. But um, in the Nidosphere, Marceline, ironically, isn't that great. Because, I think I mentioned this before. But uh, very few things actually have red projectiles in the atmosphere. The uh, ow. the um plant things, their pallet slot, their projectiles are replaced with um, blue shots, which she cannot absorb. So, check this out. No, he moved. But yeah, the banana rings, like I mentioned, completely wreck Magic Man. He's going. Oh, the meats! I must have the meats. Also, stop feeding on me. Get out of here. Guess who? Get wrecked. He's gonna drop his money. Well, I can't pick it up. Hello. <laughs> kind of spawned right on top of me there. I didn't even drop anything. What a jerk. Yeah, I'm good going to uh, just show off some of the other sub weapons since we've never done that. I just took you down. Not so good on Magic Man. Also, has no range. Magic Man. Oh. Apparently I didn't take him down the first time? How does that work? <laughs> this game is buggy, big surprise. I'm going to fall. Also, blocking projectiles is kind of funky, isn't it? Yeah. At least those guys, the tentacles, their projectiles are funny. Let's see if we can show it off. That time worked. It's like, it's certain angles, even though you clearly block it, it doesn't block. It's weird. Alright, well. Of course, when you want to show it off, it doesn't happen, but. 
I've had so many times where it's coming straight at me, I clearly block, and then the game's like, no, you get hit anyway. It's like, oh. It's like, I'm playing Spiral Knights again. I didn't miss though. That would have been such a good game if they fixed all the dang lag issues, too. Finn's imagination attacks are your standard obliterate everything on screen. They do a lot more damage than Marceline's do. Flame princesses do ridiculous amounts of damage. Her third level is just hilarious. Very few things actually survive that, except for like the highest health enemies. Which even that only take one flame shot afterwards, so it's like Yep. <laughs> Clear an entire room full of dudes. More Zaldron's over. I was going to talk about life in crud, but I think I'll save that for a different game. I kind of want to play Spel Spelunky again. I haven't played that in a few days. There's a reason I haven't been recording. Did he just like, give me your insides? Gross. <laughs> I also can't help but feel, but think naughty. Naughty thoughts. I think it refills your health. Which is useful, but I'd rather have um, flight, you know? Can we just have the end, please? Flamethrower. Everybody has this gun. really explain where you know, they got this gun. I guess it's a PvE's thing. They all have the same one. There isn't even any like unique design. They all have the same weapon. Just this multi-purpose armament that can fire out any any projectile. It's very strange. on taking things inside. Uh, 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 there's the chest. Or er, way forward. Ah, oh, it's locked. I can never say way forward anymore without feeling weird. Because I'm saying the name of a company that I hate. I hope the game isn't insanely quiet. Oh yeah, according to Amazon, my new mic should be here. I can't actually go check on that till Monday. Still waiting on the webcam, though. Okay, let's test this out. Boom. Welcome to your imagination, man! I didn't do anything! Okay, I don't know what his level 2 is supposed to do. His level 1 one is just an attack the screen thing. His level 3 one is also an attack the screen thing. I forgot that his level 2 one didn't do anything. Thank you, brave hero. <laughs> he also eats a curse you already have and then goes away. Oh Stanley, you get into so much trouble. What? Why does this Watermelon gets so many lines. I think every character has a line for this watermelon, and I don't remember why this watermelon is important. Yeah. 
Yeah, I really cannot think of why. There's a lot about the show that I don't remember. I mean, because there are a ton of episodes. That's the other thing about the 3DS game was not a lot of the music sounded the same. Like each area kind of had its own thing. And then there were songs like Party in the Clouds which were just kind of thrown in there. Yeah, Free Treasure! And my favorite song! But like this game, it has the same kind of like bass in each, um, each area. I'm like a lot thin, seriously. And it's just, I don't know, it just seems lazy. Here. And, um, Bimo! Bimo's awesome, he constantly drops healing items for you. He just seems to disappear on his own. Giggles whenever he does. Uh oh. No, oh, I like the bug. Looks cool and everything. But he's not B mode, huh? Oh no, the mother load, and I can't even take it all. Aw. 101 gold monies. Um, right, the music. The music in this game is all just the same. Which, you know, that's what you would expect from a game, but just after after hearing the 3DS game, <laughs> no no song in that game was the same as any other songs. They, were, they all had their own uniqueness. Whereas in this game, you tell it was just like the same person doing all the music, probably. So that's a really spread out map. I wonder if we're, this is our first floor that has four rooms. The most rooms a floor can have is five, and that's just stupid. Because it just makes the floor go on forever. And of course, it's switch locked. Okay, few too many dudes. I just punched right in the face. I don't remember that guy. Is he from somewhere in the show? I don't remember. Wow, that barely did any of them. Dang it, Finn! Why are your imagination attacks so useless? Only your last one is gonna be good. Did a real good job with this block. <laughs> I get the ability to block and then I never use it. You get back in your stun lock. Couldn't think of the word for a second though. There's a lot of money in there. Wow, those things make crazy sounds. Also, awesome sword. Oh, what do we got here? Oh. Oh, Eventually, Bimo will just bugger off, but he stays with you for quite a while. You get out of here, Stan. There are no females for you to the left. I can never understand Mila. She's like the Kenny of the series. You gotta listen to her a lot. Ooh. I don't mind if I often switch Bimo's gender when I'm talking about him. Nope, there he goes. Aww. She is gender neutral. 
like to think of her as a female. Mainly because she was voiced by the same lady that did Lady Rainicorn's voice, so... But even in the show, they're like constantly changing his gender. Oh, what do we got here? Every episode will be something different. Yep, four rooms. Where are all the buttons? I need to find the buttons. <coughs> Block one only to run right into another. It's pretty lenient with the amount of time you have to perfect block. See right there. I was blocking. It wasn't a good timing for a perfect block, but it was still a block, and no, nope, hits me. Look at that. That time that hit me. Though. It just looks so weird to see your character just floating on the water like that. Or not floating, but just standing on it. <clears throat> like you are now Jesus, apparently. It's like, would it really have been that hard to animate the character? Like, even just in their standing and running animations, but floating, you know, just above the ground? <laughs> it would have been too hard. Okay. Gosh, the button had better not be in the first room. I'm going to be displeased. Also, if it's your first time through this game, do not take Marceline to the uh, final stages. If you're playing alone, anyway. Just holy man, you need somebody with good. Imagination attacks and just good stats in general, and uh, Marceline doesn't have any of those. Which is sad, because she's one of the best characters, but in terms of gameplay, she's not that great. So I started a hero mode run on uh, Link Between Worlds, and it's honestly not that hard. It's just the game, but now you take double damage, that's good. Like Half the time when I do get hit, it's just me being an idiot and running right into something. Well, I was a little shocked that um, <coughs> a lot of the um, Dark World enemies, I forgot just how much damage they did to you. So now that it's doubled... Even with eight, nine hearts, a lot of things still one shot at me, so I was like, oh. Oh, I see. And this is why we have fairies, because holy crap. You know, just sauntering along, doing my thing. One shot at. Oh. Well, dang. Wasn't the right side of this room, like, exactly the same way? <coughs> oh my goodness. My throat is all bliss. Also, the button is in the first room. Oh, dang it. Game, what are you doing? Oh, what do we got here? Oh, oh, what is with the setup? What are you doing aside... Aside... Besides being incredibly... Annoying with your layouts. I mean, oh, holy please. crap. Magic Hit the fairy! Oh my goodness. This fairy. <laughs> you be quiet, Magic Man. Did you hide the button on me? I bet you did, you jerk. Okay. Ooh, money. I don't know why I care, but money. No. Into your corner, Magic Man. <coughs> Give me 
your money. Give me your insides. Uh, I think I think the money is good enough. For them. Adams, Adams. Open up. No, me meow. Checkpoints! Be right back. <laughs>